Welcome to another video. In this video, I am going to be showing you how to make an ender pearl stasis chamber. So what you're going to need is of course the ender pearls. Uh, then you will need a honey block right here. You will need a water bucket which is right here. You will need soul sand which is right here and the last thing that you will need is a piston so once you have a ender pearl honey block a water bucket soul sand and a piston what you want to do is dig one hole in the ground dig it two blocks deep soul sand water bucket other than any time you should see little bubbles come up yet yeah, there we go other than what you want to do is place a honey block on top of that. There we go. And then what you wanna do is here, you want to place a piston just like that, as you can see. And now, the last thing that you want to do is let me get a button, some redstone, and a repeater right here and what I'm gonna do is so I have my ender pearl I'm gonna come up here I'm gonna crouch by hitting circle on a PlayStation and then move the pointer as far, far out on the block and you're moving the pointer as far as it can go you can use these little pixels right here as you can see where my pointer is right in there you can use those and uh, then throw the ender pearl and it should get stuck just like that so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have this redstone can't travel more than four block or more than 12 blocks four blocks would be too short but more than 12 blocks so I am just gonna pull this not to go too far but I'm just gonna go a little bit far away when you're placing repeaters make sure it it looks like that and it's pointing towards the direction you want the the signal to go so I'm gonna place this a little bit more I'm gonna put down a button you know when I hit that button I'm gonna be teleported all the way over there so see I'm right here you can use this however you want you can go wherever you want and I'm gonna show you one more time how to put the ender pearl down. Cause w the first time I did this, I didn't do it the fir correct first time. So you wanna have, go as far out as you can. First you wanna crouch, go as far out as you can. Point, get your pointer as far back as it can go. And then throw. So technically what's doing is the soul sand you know how you make a water elevator, how the soul sand pushes you up? So it's the same thing with the ender pearl. It's pushing the ender pearl up and the honey block is just keeping it there. And then when the piston goes up, it, it like, you know when the ender pearl hits the ground, that's where you get teleported? That's basically the same thing as it hit in the ground. So if you go all, so I'm gonna go all the way over here. I'm gonna hit it, and then it pulls me over here. That is how to make an ender pearl stasis chamber in bedrock edition. Hope you enjoyed, and make sure to come back for more. See you in the next video, and please, please make sure to subscribe.